Hello, Harvard. My name is Andy Williams, and I'm a political analyst for CNN. Hello, Harvard. My name is Alexa Valdez, and I'm a reporter with Boston Globe. It is so good to be back in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Last time we were here, to admit, we had pretty good Boston baked beans. <laughs> <laughs> it's not easy to talk about the fix that cyberbullying can have on today's youth, and we know what is at risk in this debate over the Cyber Act that will ban the use of social media for anyone under the age of 21. We have two coalitions here today to discuss this bill. On our right are Children's Eyes Matter, who are proponents of the bill. <laughs> On our left are the social... Su Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me? Oh. Oh. On our left are the social supporters who are in opposition of the bill. Let's start off with Children's Eyes Matter. Miss Chase, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about the men and women who are here with you today? Hello, Harvard. I'm Elizabeth Chase. I'm a prosecutor in San Francisco, California, who prosecutes cyberbullying cases. Every time I see these cases, it breaks my heart to see kids and teenagers become so hurtful over social media. Good afternoon, Boston. Let me introduce myself. My name is Olivia Johnson. Besides being a teacher, I also have the privilege of helping victims of cyberbullying. That is why I formed a support group with the help of schools, community members, and parents. Thank you, Olivia. Hello, my name is James Martin. I am a licensed therapist on the state of California. I help kids that have been cyberbullied. I am here today in hopes that no other child will be a victim of this terrible epidemic. Good afternoon. I'm Summer Woods. It's been three months and my best friend, Sasha Yeager, committed suicide because of cyberbullying. It's been devastating for me, and I'm here today so no one else has to experience the heartbreak that I had to endure. Good afternoon. It's been one year ever since social media took my son from me. I was waiting for him at the bus stop like any other normal day, but he didn't get off. I started to worry. I went inside because the phone was shrinking, not knowing a simple phone call could change our lives forever. Oh, wow, so devastating. Um, Harvey Levin, can you please tell us a little bit about yourself? Oh, hello, my gorgeous public. I'm the amazing, inspiring Harvey Levin from what only the best show in the world, TMZ. Make sure you all follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram so I can get more millions of dollars. I mean, followers, yeah, followers. Oh, I forgot we were on live television. Oh my god, Harvey Levin, would you mind if we take a selfie? Selfie. Well, anyways, my name is Kay Grace. My life would not be complete without social media. Every moment that I'm not using it, I feel like I'm going to die of social isolation. If Congress outlaws social media, they'll be taking away a part of me that I had for as long as I can remember. Good afternoon. My name is Andrea Camanero, and I am a teacher. I teach at Teresa Hughes in Cudahy, California. I use social media to communicate with my students and give them their assignments. Good afternoon. My name is Hank Anderson, and I own a company in Los Angeles, California called Wells Health Insurance. I use Facebook to communicate with my employees. Without Facebook, I would lose a part of our daily operations, and I'm here to make sure that it doesn't happen. Here you go, Harvey. Go. If you need health insurance, by the way, call me. Hi, it's Mike Chavez. It's been over one year since I've been in the top ranks and the most feared kid in the social world. I never felt so alive after my bullying problem. With social media, I feel like a god. Now, earlier today, Children's Lives Matter won the coin toss. Can you please tell us why you support this bill? One of my students just messaged me. What just happened to Taylor Swift? I gotta find out. I need to put this on my show. Time to upload the selfie to Facebook. Let's see how many likes I can get this time. <sighs> my assistant manager just posted he won't be here today. I just turned Instagram into Instagram. Excuse me. Oh, oh sorry. 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 Oh, you didn't see anything. This is the third time. No. Anyways, we support the Cyber Act because we believe that social media is hurtful to anyone under the age of 21. Get rid of it. I hate what you're saying, Miss uh, Miss Camanera. I mean, Miss Chase. However, we believe social media is important for, let me see, uh, did I get lost in the millions or trillions? Uh, let's just leave it for trillions of reasons. 
For what many parents like me had lost their child because of social media. I'm sorry for your loss, John, but company owners need social media to keep in contact with employees. This isn't about money or company owners. Don't you realize it's about the pain that social media inflicts on children today? As a teacher, I've seen positive things come from social media. I respect what you're saying, Ms. Camanero, but you don't see what I see because I can't see without my glasses. Mr. Martin, I, I think you need to realize that social media can have a positive impact on teens. I've met several people all around the world through Facebook and Twitter. Extending tweets to strangers doesn't compare to losing your best friend. It's about time we conclude this meeting. Any final statements? Cyberbullying is a huge problem that affects nearly half American teens. Whether you've been a target of cyberbullying, know someone who has been cyberbullied, or even cyberbullied yourself, the Cyber Act is a step we could take to stop cyberbullying and keep you and your children cyber safe. Even teenagers are protected under the First Amendment, which is the freedom of speech. If a teenager is being cyberbullied, there are steps they can take to eliminate this problem, such as talking, such as a blocking contact with the cyberbully or talking to a friend about the bullying. Eliminating access to social media is not the answer. This concludes our town hall debate. Thank you, Harvard, for hosting us today. Same final statements, A, take one mark. It's about time we conclude this meeting. Any final statements? It's about time we conclude this meeting. Any final statements? One more time. It's about time we conclude this meeting. Any final statements? Thank you, Olivia. Hello, my Hold name is bell. James Mark. Social media is not <coughs> And let's cut because then it's just the moderator. Right? <coughs> yeah. Okay, let's cut. That was that was really good. <coughs> oh yeah. Okay. Wow, what a tragic story. No, no. no. Wow. Such a tragic story. Anyways, let me introduce you to Harvey Lily. Cameroni. Intro series take twelve boxes. Action. Wait, could we start? Yep, uh, and you're gonna look over here, okay? Don't look at the camera, Harvey, I have your t-shirt. Okay. Look at drink water, because my throat is dry. Sure. Okay. Followers. I mean, followers, yeah, followers. And let's do it one more time. Just for kicks. Four more. Okay, can we for clear frame? Action. One of my students just missed <laughs> And action. One of my students just messaged me. What just happened to Taylor Swift? I gotta find out. I need to put on my show. I messed up. Cut, let's do it again. You look at the camera. Yeah, I'm rolling. Scene, scene social supporters D, take one mark. Okay, and action. Action.